Hey, what's up everybody? This is Naturally Hope coming to you with another video. Um, trying to be consistent, y'all. <laughs> um, so, um, as you can see, I have five Bantu knots on my head. Why do you only have five, you ask? Well, this is one of the protective styles that um, I have been doing. I would either do Bantu knots up front or a braided headband. I don't know. I think that's what they call it. I'm not sure. I don't think it would be called a crown braid. I think the crown braid is the one that goes all the way around your head. But it's actually like, it's a braid that looks like a headband. Um, and then I would just slap a wig on in the back. Very quick protective style. All I do is put some cornrows in the back. I did two. And, um, oh, I'm... Oh, I thought that the, the camera cut off because I had to record this like a million times already. Yeah, so for this one in particular, I did five Bantu knots um, in little triangles. So what I did was I started in the center. I meant to record the video when I was doing the actual hairstyle, but I was in such a hurry that I didn't even really think to grab my camera. I just was doing my hair because I had somewhere to be. Um, and my hair was blown out as you saw in the previous video. Um, so I had to hurry up and come up with something um, because I had somewhere to be um, last night. But yeah, so what I did was I parted the front in a triangle and then for the other two I parted downwards. So the tip of the triangle is back on these two and the tip of the triangle is up front here. And then uh, for the size, the tip of the triangle is well, this is not really much of a triangle, but you get the idea. It's up front here. So five bantu knots. And then all I did was, let me grab my wig cap. All I did was put a wig cap in the back where the cornrows are, my cornrows. And then I put a half wig on. And that's pretty much what I did because I needed something quick. So if you want something quick and cute, even if you were going to like a banquet or something, you could do something like this. Um, uh, particularly the braided headband if you're going to like a banquet. I was just going to a, like a, a party, um, a lounge. Um, so I did something like this because it's a little funky in the front. And um, for the half wig, this is actually really, really old. I've had this for maybe a good four or five years now this is the um sensational coils kinks and curls half wig in the style <sighs> rule breaker i always have to think about the name but it's in the style rule breaker and all i did was take it and put it on in the back so i just find kind of where my hair starts back here where the cornrows are i take it and i put the combs in for the back I see, you know you might have to slide your wig cap back a little bit trying to look in the mirror here as I put it in and then I take it to the back and stick those combs in and that's it and for extra security on the sides here I put some bobby pins to hold it because it, it kind of slides once once it gets on like this part slides a little bit so I just pull it up and then I put some bobby pins on the side to kind of hold that tight and that's it that is the hairstyle you guys this wig is like hella cute. This is in the color 1B. Um, I do also have it in the color 1B27. It's like an ombre, black at the root, uh, strawberry blonde on the back, but that one is kind of ratty, so I'm, I'm gonna need to get a new one, but I think they're sold out of that one, but I'm fine with the black, it's okay. I'm feeling my dark colors. Y'all know I used to have like this whole thing with coloring my hair all the time, and I learned my lesson from that, y'all, so. Yeah, so this is it. Um, you could do it with the bantu knots or the headband braid. You just do a cornrow going across your head, put on the wig cap, not across your full head, just the front part. You part it like from ear to ear, from ear to ear, you part it, and that's about as much hair as you need to do the braid or the bantu knots. That's how I do it. So I just wanted to share that with you all. I'm sorry I didn't get a chance to record but i wanted to at least show you a little something um i'm sure we're all familiar us naturals that have been natural for years now how to do bantu knots i have been natural and well in october of this year it will be 12 years natural for me because i did go natural in october of 2010 um we are now in 2022 12 years natural y'all mm. never going back to the creamy crack 
so yeah so at the end of the video I'm gonna post um the picture of how I had it with my makeup and you know the finished look and I'll also post another picture of when I did the headband braid and I had another wig another half wig in the back which is the Annie wig by Altre it's like a long um kinky kinky straight is that what they call it um a long kinky straight um wig and it was really really cute that one I had a performance and I had to do something real quick because my hair was blown out as well um, I've been blowing out my hair a lot after I wash it nowadays um yeah especially when I want to style it in like a, a bun or something I always blow it out because it's so much easier for me to put it in a ponytail um I recently had a wedding um I was in um a bridesmaid in my friend's wedding and I had to do a low ponytail so I blew my hair out and I was able to gather a good amount of my hair into the ponytail because when it's in its normal state, it's so hard to gather because my hair is so thick. It's like hella, hella thick. That's my mama's jean. She got that thick, thick hair. Um, so yeah, so that's it. I'm not going to keep rambling. I just wanted to show you all what, um, show you all a quick hairstyle, maybe for the summer. If you have like a party or something to go to, you want to do something real quick, get you a half wig, do something in the front, slap it on in the back and you'll be good to go beat your face up and you'll be hella cute for the summer or for any other season. All right, guys. So thank you so much for watching. And I hope that you all have a wonderful uh, morning, afternoon, evening, whatever time you're watching this. I hope that you have a great day and I will post the pictures at the end. Don't forget to follow me on social media. I will post all of my information down in the description box. Later, guys. Deuces.